parliament is the legislature. Mm. Um, uh, cabinet is the executive. Government falls under the executive. Parliament falls under the executive because um, not under the executive, but it falls under the government because it is a group of legislators that make up policy making which regulates governance. The executive is a uh, cabinet. The president is the chairperson of cabinet, but has no influence over cabinet, uh, over parliament. You understand? The president can only be summoned by parliament, but the president cannot be a member of parliament because he has a representative in parliament, which is the key uh, chief administrator of government business in parliament, which is the mm, mm, the prime minister. You understand, mm, yeah. Sunday. So young people have really not understand um, this the the yeah. acts that regulate these yeah. establishments and these appointments and how things happen. So we just talk in isolation. You understand. Yeah. And we don't know that if you want, you know, once I was doing um, a research on how different omas of the state play an imperative role in nation building and poverty eradication. So I spoke to the Prime Minister and um, the Prime Minister granted me access to every government um, ministry in omas of the state in the Republic of Namibia. I was granted access to go and speak to each minister if, if of each ministry, speak to the Attorney General, speak to the Prosecutor General, mm -hmm. yes, Sunday, speak to the um, um, the Director General, um, no, mm -hmm. in the ACC, the Director General of the ACC, um, also with the, the Central Intelligence Services um, mm -hmm. uh, um, director, uh, Intelligence um, Director, yes. So I was granted access to all these officers by the office of the Prime Minister because the Prime Minister is the head of government or, um, business in Parliament, so every government minister in Oma of the state reports to the Prime Minister. 